Hi, this is Teddy, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist, trainer, and coach. And the question I got asked is, how can I stop all of these social media platforms from sending me emails every time they want to tell me something? And I have a couple ways to do that, and I'm going to show you in this video. So first of all, if one of the things you could do is create a filter. Now I'm going to grab the URL. I don't have any emails coming to me from LinkedIn, but I'm going to grab this, this email address right here, copy the email address, and go do a search for that email address. Now these are all the emails. It happens to be a forwarded one. It doesn't make any difference. But I'm going to show you how to block emails from LinkedIn support. So bring that up. Click on the show search options. When you show search options, what you can do is you can actually put this up here from LinkedIn support at CS. And you don't even have that in there if you don't want it. But then you create filter. Here are the options. I can skip the inbox, which is going to archive it. It's going to leave it in the all mail box, but it's not going to be in my inbox. I could, or furthermore, I can mark it as read if I want to. Or I can simply just do this, delete it. And all the mail that comes in from this email address will, will automatically be deleted. Now, what that means, it's going to move, move it over into the trash box. And every 30 days, the trash box gets empty, and so does the email that's in there. This is probably the easiest way to get rid of the messages once they are sent to you. But I have another idea. might be worthy of looking at. Here's the other idea. Go to each one of those platforms or the platform that's sending you all that email and tell it to stop. On LinkedIn, you can go to settings, go to email, and you can make a decision what email messages you want or don't want. And it'll pretty much turn off almost all of it. The only thing you want to keep is anything account related in case there's a problem with your account. But everything else, make it go away by not even by telling LinkedIn not to send it to you. How about Facebook? You can go to Facebook settings, which is over here on the down arrow, settings right here, and you can go to notification settings, and you can make a decision what emails you want. Turn off anything that's email related you don't want. People you may know, maybe you want to get an email for that. It's off, but if I have it turned on, I can say send me an email or push notification or SMS, I turn it off. Anything I don't want, birthdays I don't want, videos I don't want, events I don't want, you can see they're all turned off in Facebook. On Instagram, you go to email and SMS and you can say subscribe to blah, 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 turn it all off. Look, shopping bags. I don't want shopping bags. You can turn all that off. And then the last one I have, the only ones that I really use, is Twitter. In Twitter, I can go to um, uh, under notifications or go under settings, skew under more and settings, under settings as email notifications. And I can say, leave it on or leave it off. You know what? Turn it all off. I don't want any of it. And the reason why I turn it all off is because I go to Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and LinkedIn on a regular basis. I can get all the notifications from within those apps. And I don't want to clutter up my inbox with all those duplicate messages that already exist in the social media platform. I'm Teddy Burris, your Google Workplace and Gmail strategist, trainer, and coach. I hope these ideas are helpful for you.